there guys, it's me, Kitty Heart, and um, I guess today is my first official story time, I guess. I don't know, just something <laughs> super fucking weird happened to me at work today, and I just have to tell someone. <laughs> I don't know if I just have this like, weirdo's welcome sign on my forehead, or I, I don't know. But this isn't the first time I've gotten a super weird-ass customer. I'm just glad someone else was there to witness it this time. This guy comes in, and, like, it's Remembrance Day today, so it's a Manitoba law that we can't sell anything other than essentials at, in between 9 a.m. and 1 p.m. And so we were just explaining that to someone... And, um, I guess me and him started chatting because it's a really slow day and he was the only one in the store. And then I told him about how I started smoking again after five years. Yeah, yeah, I know, I know, I know, I know, I know. But I was really stressed out and he's like, that's a piss poor excuse. And I'm like, yeah, I know. And he's like, I, can't, I don't think I can get the exact words right, but it was like, Oh, I'm gonna take you and put you over my knee and spank you like your daddy shoulda. And like, holy fuck! Like, I don't know. The second he left, my two co-workers just kind of turned at me with eyes like wide open like, what the fuck just happened? And I'm like, I'm so uncomfortable right now. <laughs> Oh, it just, it gave me full body cringes and I just, I couldn't deal. I can't, uh, it's, oh, <laughs> why, why do, why do people feel like that's okay to say to people? Like, uh, I know I'm going to get a lot of hate for this, but me and uh, my co my male co-worker, he, we looked at each other at sort of around the same time and he's like, and we we both sort of said it, and he's, I guess we were like, oh, he must be a Trump supporter. <laughs> I don't know. I, I'm not really into the whole politics thing, because, like, we're fucked always round. But that was just, I don't know, it was, it hit me right in my giggle dick. It was perfect. But that was just, like, one of the absolute creepiest things that has ever happened to me. Like, I've had people swear at me, I've had people make me cry, but, like... I've had people give me their phone numbers, but, like, never... I don't know. That was creepy. <laughs> Just, like, I don't know. I don't know. I had to tell someone. I'm sorry. It's... I don't know how to react. <laughs> but anyway, that's all, uh, all I have for today. I have to finish cleaning my house, and, and my boyfriend gets off work soon. Yay! Um... So yeah, thanks for listening. <laughs> I guess I'll talk to you later. Bye!